Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. It is, I think, seven something in the morning. And when I look at the clock, it's at seven o'clock. I just got up, got dressed, I'm out here walking my pooch, and of course I threw my hair in at seven in the morning. But I got compliments, and that really makes me feel good. So, lazy ladies, self love. Do something that makes you feel awesome about yourself. Whether it's hair, lip gloss. You know, losing that weight is the best self-care any, anybody could do. So, ladies, I implore you, do something to take care of yourself. Um, I bought, I told you I bought, I did a video on Savage X Fenty undergarments. I wasn't ashamed to show you how big they are. I have a big booty. And, and of course, my, you know, it's going to be a little bit bigger so but um self-care yeah guys do as much as you can to self-care then you will love self love you um uh, it all goes hand in hand so i'm out here with my puppy to get steps in and also i am super excited to announce that i am doing the well, one that panda she almost tripped me oh well. Ooh, this dog sometimes okay back to the challenge that i'm doing it's for the american cancer society if you go on their facebook page you should see it there in the month of december i am going to try to no i'm going to do the 1550 come on pan this way 1000 oh sorry about that guys trying to readjust myself because dog wants to go one way and I want to go the other so um it is 1550 squats for the whole month of December that comes out to 50 a day guys and I'm not a best squatter because I have really really bad knees guys and but I want to do it I'm going to um put my fundraiser page together this is not something fake i'm doing this to help raise money for people that really have cancer now people fake it to to make that buck and it's disgusting how people use cancer to get views because not only one of our girls did that i truly didn't believe she got i mean you can't get cancer when you when you are obese but you can also have a simple DNC when you're bleeding like that. But, all right guys, let me be, clean up this dog mess and I'll be right back. Okay guys, I am back. And as I was saying, I am doing this fundraiser. This dog, come on Panda, we're going for a walk. Um, I am doing this fundraiser because I've been affected by people in my life that had cancer. And they didn't lie about it. My grown grandmother had lung cancer, they took a piece of her lung out, I think it was, it was when I was little, when I was 11 or 12 years old when that happened. So I can't remember the exact te details, but I know she had lung cancer. And I know I've, I've had other people die that I knew from, from cancer. And like I said, I truly don't believe a certain person has cancer because her favorite idol, Shane Dawson, also was out and out for lying about having cancer. Um, and she does whatever. Shane Dawson, Jeffree Star, and what's that stupid one? Trisha Potato Head does too. So, because uh, she wants to be on that level of having millions of subscribers. But she would have had that if she would have just lost the weight. That's not so hard to understand, guys. She would have been. Uh, Panda, come on. Oh, my dog does not want to to walk up this hill. Panda, come. Panda, what's the matter? She's having a moment in her day in this morning. Oh, well, guys. But, you know, she wants that level of success. And imagine the level of success if she would have lost all that weight from the beginning when she was only three, three and change. I forgot her actual starting weight. 
So I know I should do my homework on these girls, but they sick of me when I watch the old videos. But yes, guys, I am doing that. I tried to leave a link to the fundraiser page. I have no anything linked to it, like my bank account. I'm not here to do that. And I will record myself doing 50 squats every single day for 31 days in December. I will show you proof. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to show proof to their cause, but I used to do 50 squats a day and I'm a little bit heavier now. Man, that Thanksgiving dinner can kill you. I gained a few pounds from that, but this girl's on a mission because my wonderful subscribers has gotten me so motivated, so much more motivated to take care of myself. And I want to be a success story as well. I want you, all you guys to be success stories in your own way, whether it's in weight loss, your job, maybe starting your own business. So we all can do this together, guys. I'm dead serious. Obesity needs to stop killing people in this country. We have such, basically, I told you before, the stats are, are like, I thought we were at half at the 50% mark, but we're not that far from being at the 40% mark. I know it was 30 something percent at the time. This dog, look, she is, look at, this is what an English bulldog does. She has to have it her way, or it's no way at all. And sometimes I literally yank her, and people may think that is dog abuse. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't mean to, you know, shake the camera and stuff, but I have to readjust because, you know, everything has to be about panda. That's why my channel is called Living in a Panda's World. My kids are that way, same way sometimes, you know, I have to give in to them. Because I spoil my little guys. Panda. So, oh, and next Saturday morning. Not this Saturday morning. But the following Sunday. She's getting fixed. And I had an issue with my other dog. I wasn't. I was not feeling good. I don't like when dogs go into surgery. Because they can die too. Just like people. So. Um, I'm sitting here walking back and forth. This child does not want to walk. Come on, Panda. Come on, let's walk. Come on. <sighs> Yes, it's, it's, uh, <laughs> it's not fun to walk with a bulldog on some days, because especially when it's raining, they don't even want to go outside the door, and I don't know why. Come on, Panda. I think she's trying to sniff out squirrels. You know how dogs are squirrels. This is how this dog, she, you see the tree back here? She ran, literally ran up to the tree and almost tried to climb it up, climb up on it. She's a dog. How is she going to climb up on this tree? So, but... Yes, I'm doing that for the month of December. I want to help out cancer um, patients. I want to make that money to help them, help people who have who truly have cancer. Come on, Panda. She is really being um, a jerk right now. Look. Come on, Panda. <laughs> See, I literally yank it on her. So, but yeah. <sighs> I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving yesterday. And I don't hate on you. If you guys, um, I see a squirrel, I'm waiting for her to see if she smells it or whatever. And then yank my arm off. But I hope you guys really enjoyed your day with your family yesterday. I know a lot of you won't be watching my videos because you're out Black Friday shopping. I, oh, let me tell you, my daughter, we were talking to her grandmother last night. And <laughs> she put her, she did, she glammed it up a little bit. She wanted to feel good about herself to go to work. And her grandma's like, I don't know why she's putting them eyelashes on and her hair in, her wig. My daughter wears wigs and she, you wouldn't believe it. I have to insert her pictures in here. I'll show, I'll show you what she looks like. I'll enter, insert her, her pictures at the end. And she's wearing wigs, you know. Her hair is growing. That's why she was wearing hair extensions and um, wigs and stuff. Come on, Panda. So, because she was to straighten her hair and, and that burns her hair off. So, but... This dog is not doing anything for me right now. I'm trying to even keep moving to get my steps in. But guys, let me implore you to do things for yourself. You will feel good about yourself. This I love that. This is if you want to go get this hair, it's from insert name here. And it's the Shayla Ponytail. You can get it in different colors. Mine is in jet black, of course. I need you could tell I need to dye my hair it's that time. And my own hair turns gray because I have no you could tell I'm white, white up there because I have no more pigmentation there. And my my hair doesn't come in black anymore. Or really, it's really a, 
a dark brown, but I dyed it black, jet black. So, but yes, guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed your day yesterday. If you gained a few pounds, hey, so be it. That's what I'm telling you. Walk, do an exercise plan. This girl will not let me. Come on, Panda, let's go then. Come on. She's stubborn today. She's definitely being her bulldog self. But I hope you really enjoyed your, your day with your family. And if you're out Black Friday shopping, please, 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 please be safe out there. I'm going to go DoorDash later. I didn't do it yesterday. They were offering like $3 extra dash. But I wanted to stay hang out with my son. We had a great time. We watched a show I wish you guys can watch. If you have um, HBO Max, I think, or HBO it's a um, show called Lovecraft Country. Awesome. And a lot. it really hurt my heart because it really showed how racist, because it's based in 1930s. It really showed how racist they were towards um, African-Americans back then. So, and we are having this debate. I was talking to my kids and they said, a lot of people don't like being called African-Americans. A lot of people don't like being called blacks. We are human beings. And the reason why I want everybody to start saying African-Americans is because they are descendants of Africans. My kids are descendants of Africans that were brought over here. So, let me tell you. I have to tell you a story about how their family started. It's a beautiful, it was a love story actually. So, I think, um, I'm th I know I might have mentioned it, and who we were related, my kids were related to Emma Smith. He is descended from that family of slaves. So it was a slave trader fell in love with a slave and that's how their family came about. That's the simplest love story can be, a slave trader. Yes. So, but we about to go in here. Um, she does not feel like walking today. So I'm just gonna walk around my house. So with that being said, you guys have a great day and enjoy your day. If you have it off, if you're working, I'm so sorry. I'm off for my one school, but I'm working the other one. So you guys have a great day. We can tell you coming into the building and I'm still gonna walk around my apartment. So you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you soon.